Good day everyone! Before I proceed to my entry, I would like to introduce myself first. Um, this is Regine Fresnido Tunay, 19 years of age from zone number 1043, Barangay Bagajon, Municipality of Libmanan, Province of Camarinesur. I am a second year student taking Bachelor of Science in Teresa Management at Mariners Polytechnic Colleges Incorporated, Naga Campus. I will be bringing you to one of the best and historical ancestral house here in Libmanan. I will introduce you to a place of origin of once extended family, particularly the home owned and preserved by the Sam family for several generations. So what are you waiting for? Madana <laughs> Kadako na gagayo na darag sa limanan Pati mga lugar na tayo mo na malilingawa Kadako na gagayo na darag sa limanan Pati mga lugar na tayo mo na malilingawa Kadako na gagayo na darag sa limanan Pati mga lugar na tayo mo na malilingawa Roldan's Ancestral House Located in Poblacion, Lidman, and Camarinesur This house is the Roldan Ancestral House or known as the Morales Building, built by Reverend Father Mariano Roldan for his parents Don Francisco Roldan and Doña Agapita Roldan e Mercado. He was the second regular native clergy from Libmanan who was ordained in 1907 next to Bishop Sancho in 1903. This house was built in 1937 as inscribed in the facade of building when Libmanan was occupied by the Japanese Imperial Forces. The house became one of the garrisons since the place was the station for cavalry where the houses were situated used in the rendas or factual inspections of the Japanese officers. Through the years, the house becomes one of the significant landmarks of the town because of its imposing grandeur and structural beauty that is unique only to the town or even in Bicol. It is one of the examples of neoclassic architectural design during the time when it was built. It echoes the dominant art deco design of the building were geometric lines and stucco that used the concrete iron and cement in the building. It was believed that the imposing monument of the two birds that stand to the seemingly modern castle in the tower of the building is the insignia or the coat of arms of the Roldan clan in Spain. True, the building is primarily modern and American in style. Still, the floor plans of the house is native or Filipino that can be observed in the small rooms 
and even wooden stiff staircases of the house. One of the significant designs also of the house is the carved Philippine flag, which was not allowed to be publicly displayed that time. In one of its frescoes in the facet of building, which was quite unique of the time, since we are still in the hands of the Americans, through in the Commonwealth period from 1935 to 1946. When Father Mariano died, the house was inherited by his only sister, Doña Rosario Roltan, who was married to Don Pablo Rocha. Later, the house was sold to the Morales family, and when the family moved out to America, they rented Koreans who rebuilt the PNR Bridge of Libmana. Furthermore, it was said that the original at the top of the tower in between the two birds, one of the sculptural pieces that stood, there was a woman sitting on a half moon and because of the weather, it was detached from the original design of the house. It was also said that the builder of this house built a tunnel that connects to the church. So again, this is the Roldan's ancestral house history. Thanks guys for watching. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And click the notification bell for more updates and for more upcoming videos. Bye guys!